Okay, we're looking at the left transition of the left foot on this one. Um, so we put the wedge just underneath the inside of the heel. We have the left leg, which was a gate post, and we want to keep the knee nice and straight on that one. And then we just lightly tuck the pelvis under. Now from there, the easier way to do it for people whose back um, starts to niggle a little bit with this is to rotate this way. So we're just using the pelvis. So as I pivot on my right foot, I start to rotate my pelvis, which then when it runs out of space, starts to pick up my thigh bone, which then starts to rotate all the way down to my foot. And my foot, the ball of the big toes will likely get on the floor, but the arch starts to lift up. So that's from the pelvis. Then, if that movement feels okay, then we started to put the arm in. So we just started to rotate back with that left hand. Again, keeping that light tuck under and letting the movement come all the way down to the foot. And then we use the right hand and we can reach across this way to get the same kind of movement. And you might feel a little stretch starting to come through the back of that right shoulder as well. 